This program contains adult themes, mild pain, strong language, and scenes some viewers might find offensive. Ah! You're taking the piss. You just put shush on my leg. Do you get it? Yeah, I get it. It looks so chavvy. Look at it. What is the story behind this tattoo? Like, wh wh why shush? When I'm sharing something with Sharice, she likes to tell me to shh. And she'll just be like, shh, 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 every time I speak to her. And it infuriates me. So I just thought, if I put this back on her, I'm telling her to shush permanently. It's so bad. That was a brave move from Cameron. But how brave is he going to be after he sees his tattoo? You may remove your feet, goggles! Oh, that's sick! Yeah. That's actually sick! <laughs> Sharice, can you explain the story behind the tattoo? The night I met Cam, he was actually hitting on my girlfriend. So the first thing I said to him was, easy tiger. tiger. It's just a little reminder to stop hitting on lesbians, especially uh -uh. ones that are taken, dear. Zoe, what is the story behind this tattoo? Oh my god. John's a massive mummy's boy, and me and his mum have fallen out majorly because she's so opinionated and doesn't know when to keep her beak out. She's gonna fucking hate you. I don't care. Zoe has branded her man and slagged off his mum all in one tattoo. She is savage. You may remove your fear goggles, Zoe. What the fuck is that? Why have you put a potato on me? <laughs> That's not funny. It's a couch potato. That's an absolute fucking arsehole. Whenever I come home from work, you're sat on the sofa. You don't do any washing up. Can you don't wash my clothes? You never make Wash dinner. my fucking clothes, George. You're a fucking arsehole. Dickhead. Shit. Mate, that's beef. Got a fucking potato on my back. Come and sit on the couch. Come and sit on the couch. Oh, I'm a bit scared that if we sit on the couch, we're replicating the tattoo. You've got to start sticking up for yourself, mate. I know, mate. You just let her walk all over you, mate. You are Zoe's bitch. <laughs> I just can't stop looking at the potato. I just think it's so cute. I want to give it a little hug. You're an awesome. awesome. I don't care. You're not awesome. funny. Zoe, can you forgive Jordan for the cute couch potato? No. Get down on your knees, Jordan. You're gonna have to beg. He's got potential, no? I'm really sorry. I'm calling you lazy. And? Being a bitch. And? Jordan has melted into a pathetic little puddle on the floor. You're a true wallaby now. You're an official Australian. You're ruined my ass. So Alex, what is the story behind this tattoo? Ever since like we've been in grade eight together, we've been very competitive and I gave him the wallaby. So you're, wow. you're barracking for Australia now, not England. So you've branded your English best friend with the Aussie rugby symbol? I don't think I'll be allowed back in my house. That mm. sucks. Right, come on you, we'll swap yous over, come right, on. let's go. Come on, Jason, drip it off. Oh! 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 Alfie, what's the story? We all know Alex is the old womanizer. The stories I've been hearing is it only lasts a minute, so. This 
This is what happens when competitiveness goes too far. Alf is lucky that he wasn't at the end of Alex's fist. Hi, I'm Charlotte Crosby, and if you're enjoying this channel as much as I think you are, hit the subscribe button for even more amazing MTV videos.